Hi guys, welcome back to a new vlog. <laughs> I just went and got groceries and I'm sweating. It's literally so hot outside and my cart was just so heavy. <gasps> Hi, oh my god, I'm dying over here. Still need to unpack. Ooh, let me open up a window because it's literally so fucking hot. Whenever the sun shines on our apartment, it gets so hot in here, it's insane. I'm like dying. So, welcome back. This morning, I had my coffee, just had like a chill morning. Um, I'm home alone today. And whew, I've started some laundry. I need to go take out my laundry and put in another load in a second. But I also want to take out some groceries. Let me do a grocery haul. I got some paper towels. Strawberries. I feel like it's really dark. Is it? Oh, it is. Wait. Like that. Okay. Oh my god, I'm dying, y'all. Strawberries. I got some eggs. And I got an eight pack of Fanta. The essentials. Got two of my vanilla syrup because I just opened my last one. So I like to always have some in stock at home. I got. Some sour wine gums. Got some wipes, some wet wipes, like to clean it. And then I got some salmon. I got some chicken. I got two tubs of my favorite ice cream. This is my favorite ice cream. I go through this like I eat one of those like in a, one night after like smoking. I'll eat the whole thing. I don't like my hair today. 
Oh, my laundry's done. I just heard. Um, but it was sold out all week last week, so I didn't have my ice cream, and it sucked. Got some soy milk. I got these like hot dogs, just like the cheap ones. These are like a, a euro or something. These are so good. I love just having those whenever I feel like it. And then lastly, I got three packs of apple juice, just like a six pack. I'm obsessed with these and I I could just get like the whole what's it called like um a, a carton I think but I like having it in these tiny ones especially when I like smoke and stuff and at night time I just grab them all the time and these have paper shells which I guess is better but I hate the shawls like the plastic shawls just are better but it's fine let me go ahead and put this in the fridge real quick that much work today um what i do have to do is finish organizing my closet which i'm filming a video for that and i started a couple days ago and then i was just like so over it so i'm gonna finish that today first just gonna do my laundry right now i also still need to pick up a package so i think after i do this loaded laundry i'm going to pick that up i need to check if it's open because it's king's day today totally forgot about that <laughs> but it's king's day so i don't know if it's open but i do need to pick that up take off my shoes for one second because my feet are burning up laundry is like my favorite thing to do nowadays it really makes me feel like an adult and i love just like i don't know i love doing laundry let me know if you like doing laundry <sighs> i'm gonna turn on some music and do this oh, i'm dying some of the songs I've been loving because I get asked about like my playlist all the time. I have a playlist, it's just not public. I feel like if I put a playlist public, I just want to make sure it's a really good one. And I usually just put like a bunch of random shit in my playlist and it's not cohesive at all. It's just whatever I've been liking. But some of my current favorite songs, before I do my laundry, I'm just going to tell you. I'm going to go through this playlist and just name them all and... You can save them or listen to them if you want, if you don't know them. I love Ways by Janae Aiko. I've been obsessed with her. I've always loved her music. Ooh, okay. I've always loved her music, but I feel like once I saw her tiny desk, I became obsessed. Like, I listen to that all the time. So that's Justin's tiny desk. I feel like his tiny desk, like, the way he performs the songs in those in that like performance it's just so much better than the way they are like the studio version so i don't know um so ways by janae aiko i've been loving Givian. i think that's how you pronounce his name it's like stuck on you like i want you heartbreak anniversary kind of basic but i just love it there's this random like old ass song by jeremiah i think that's how you say jeremiah it's called love don't change stars in the sky by janae aiko and aura i think his name is what else? I've been loving No Tomorrow Part 2 by Brandy and Ty Dolla Sign. I've been loving, of course, Streets by Doja Cat is always a good one. Eternal Sunshine by Janae Aiko. Moments by Janae Aiko. Still Your Best by Givian. See You Again by Ty the Creator. And Kali, ooh, I don't know how to pronounce her last name. Don't ask me. Real Life by Burner Boy and Stormzy. It's kind of old, I think, but I still like it. World We Created by Givian. What else? Above and Beyond by Janae Aiko. Honestly, just Justin's Journals album. I still put songs from that in my playlist. It's like one of his best albums, in my opinion. Any Blackbird song. I always put random Blackbird songs in my playlist. Um, Deja Vu by Olivia Rodrigo. I feel like she gets a lot of hate online. I don't know why. I don't know anything about her, but I think her songs are really good. I like that song. Kiss Me More, obviously, by Doji Gat and SZA. Sun Come Down by Chance the Rapper. Three Nights by Dominic Fike. 
and yeah that's kind of the songs i've been putting on repeat and i'm gonna go do my laundry now <laughs> let me turn it on i'm gonna put on sun come down decided I'm not gonna pick up the package today because I honestly just don't feel like walking all that way again I just my cart was so heavy it killed my body and I never really talk about this in the vlog but my body like aside from ow I, I'm bleeding aside from the fact that I don't work out I have really weak knees and like my muscles just are I don't know so like little things like that literally will just make my body hurt so bad and genetically my mom does have some stuff that could possibly be what I'm experiencing but I don't want to just I guess diagnose myself I still need to go to the doctor to get that checked out but like my body's just oh that killed me <laughs> um because I walk around a lot like I'm I don't work out but I have been walking a lot since I moved so it's like I'm definitely a lot more fit I guess than I was but my body's just weak as fuck, so. Something I just quickly want to tell you guys is in the last vlog, you saw me shoot for Snipes, the whole, like, behind the scenes. So the styling haul video that I did with Snipes is going to be out today when this vlog comes out. Not sure what time, but I know this vlog comes out at 9 p.m. CET, and it's, I don't know, but either way. Well, that video is going to be out today, so make sure to go check it out. I'm going to leave... A link down below um, to their YouTube channel so you can check it out. I haven't seen it myself yet, um, but I'm really excited to see it. I actually need to ask my manager if I can have a look because I'm really excited to see how that is. Um, but yeah, make sure to go check that out. I'm going to leave a link down below and I'm so excited for you guys to see it. I'm going to be going back again next month. So there's going to be another one just so you know. It's really exciting. I'm gonna go look at some home decor and then I really need to answer some comments on my Instagram and stuff because I haven't been doing that. I've been slacking on that. And then I'm gonna finish my closet. I think I'm first gonna have some lunch and then I'm gonna finish my closet. Shouldn't take too long. And then I just need to edit that video. That's gonna be like all I have to do for work today. And then tomorrow, I'm also vlogging tomorrow. I'm gonna film tomorrow. I'm gonna shoot. Just taking you through my two days. I also tan. My my face isn't as tan anymore. It always comes off a lot faster. Fake tan has been my savior because I obviously haven't been able to go on a holiday. Hopefully this summer. I've actually not. Hopefully I'm gonna travel this summer. I dude. I need to. I really just need to travel this summer. And I hope it's not gonna be too hard. I'm not gonna go too far. Like I literally all I wanna do is just like rent like a big ass airbnb villa in like spain or something and just go there with like my mom i want to go there for my birthday really bad just take like my close family so like my brother my mom my sister and then my fabian could come if she wants to luca you know kind of my circle those are the people that i see and I just want to just sit there and lay in the sun and not think about anything. But I do want to go to like an Airbnb, just like 
distant from people i might actually go on a trip next month with my management it's like a, a work trip where we like shoot content with like a bunch of brands in portugal so they've asked me to come and they're they're renting out this like place and there's like a couple girls going and we're just gonna like shoot a bunch of content there so hopefully i can do that i'd love to just you know obviously i'll make sure i get tested and everything and then i'll go right back home but i haven't the only place i've traveled literally was to germany for snipes like that was the first time i traveled in like a year and no longer year and a half almost two years and especially suck because growing up i've never been able to go on vacation i've never been on vacation out of the country with my mom and my brother like us as a family we've never done that so i really really want to do that this summer especially because i can afford it now like i want to take advantage of that you know we'll see what happens the next day i'm just going to finish up editing last night i just wasn't feeling it i was finally done with everything then i sat down to edit and i was like nope i'm not doing it i just wasn't feeling too good so i'm gonna finish that right now and then i'm gonna put on makeup and take some oh my god take some photos ignore my hair by the way i just popped it into a ponytail but you can see my tracks in the back like it's fine I think I'm gonna get braids again after this because it's it's really cute. It's just so much work and I don't have time for it. Anyways, last night I ended up smoking and then I sat. This was the first time I did this and it was so nice. I'm gonna do this all the time. I sat in my bedroom. I mean, I could only I could only do it because it was nice weather. Tonight it's gonna be pretty good as well, I think, and then it's just gonna be cold again. But I sat by my bedroom window and it was so nice. Like. I just watched the moon like I watched the sun go down and then I watched the moon come up and it just looked so nice I just had music on on my TV with my airpods in I was just chilling I put my chair by the window so I just sat there for like a good like hour like two so that was really nice I'm gonna do that more often I ordered some home decor this morning which when it comes in I'll show you it's like partially furniture partially home decor really excited there's some new stuff coming in again ordered some clothes as well i made like a huge order on motel rocks because their stuff is just so cute but it's gonna be for a video as well like i have a bunch of stuff to show in a video so that's fun i send in some tattoo design ideas to the girl who's been designing most of my tattoos for the past like year like last year i got quite a few no not last year the year before that i got some tattoos she designed some of them and then also last year I think the last time I got tattoo was in August, which I totally forgot about. I got the, um, this one, and I got this one, and this one as well, the cherry. So I sent her three ideas. Um, one of them is quite big. It's a hand piece. I'm just going to tell you guys. One of them is a hand piece. I want to get this whole hand tattooed, and then I want to do this one afterwards. I first want to kind of fill up the sleeve, so... I want to have like two full sleeves with hand tats like pieces together eventually I got I have a design that I want to put over here I think if it fits if not I'll have to like put it somewhere else um and then the hand piece and then there's just this really small it's just like my mom's birth year I wanted her to just like write in like a specific font that I saw of someone else's tattoo like I want it exactly like that and I didn't feel like searching for a font to look like it I was like I'll just have her write it out and I'm gonna put there put that somewhere on my body. I don't know where yet. Let me go edit now because I'm just rambling. But stay tuned for that. It's gonna be in a vlog probably when I get it done.
I just finished shooting just literally a really quick mirror selfie and outfit like detail shot um i said it in my last vlog i'm just feeling mentally kind of not not there so i want to get it done really fast um so it's nice i need to go eat something i'm feeling kind of nauseous i haven't really ate much today which also usually happens when i'm not feeling my best but i really like how the makeup turned out though i think it's super cute because it comes like the pop of color with my bra and then i also use my bag in the photo this bag is from glide i don't know how you pronounce it but super cute oh if i don't forget i'll link my outfit below basically just wearing this top from um revolve it's kind of like a cardigan and then i'm wearing some flares from um Bershka. Curled my hair. It's kind of like 70s vibes. Like the super, I don't know, I think it's cute. But I'm definitely going to get braids again ASAP because I don't have time. I need to film, or I don't need to while I'm going to film um, the get to know me tag four years later. Because I filmed a get to know me tag when I, like, I think it was my second video on YouTube. And I, I watched it. Like last week and I was like, I should like do an update. I should like come back, answer the questions and like watch it back and see what I said back then. So I'm going to do that right now. I think that'll be really fun. And I think I'm literally just going to sit at my desk. I thought that'd be fun to do because I was so different back then. And I only watched it because I filmed that um, Q&A about my social media career. What happened? Did I break my... I watched it when I filmed that video because I wanted to see what videos were still up and I was like I was so little and awkward and I look so ugly. Dude, I have the biggest glow up, thank god, but I was also really depressed at the time so I can't even blame myself for looking like that. <laughs> just gonna do that, I think it'll be fun, it'll be a nice like just random video in between, just lighthearted. I don't know if it's gonna get many views, probably not. I don't think a lot of people care, but I just thought it'd be fun to do. And sometimes I just wanna film something that I think is fun and not necessarily focusing on views, you know what I mean? Oh, 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 no.